If there's a loan and this is the monthly payment, this is an amortization table. There's the payment each month. That's the interest paid. That's the principal reduction. And that's the balance column. Now, if we want to spill an amortization table, well, 360 are the number of rows plus 1, comma, comma. But we have to have time 0, so we start at 0. Guess what? We have to use sequence again. Only 360 rows, but I need to minus, because I want to show this as a positive, I need to repeat this. So we're starting at PMT with a step of 0. To get an array of the interest payments, hey, there's the period rate, comma. And I really need everything that spills from here, but we don't need time 0. So we use drop, and I'm dropping only the first row. Total number of periods, 360. Present value, I'm putting in minus 300,000, even though that's the incorrect cash flow, because tab, I want to see it as a positive. Principal reduction, hey, there's the amount we pay each month, minus the contractual extraction of interest, tab. And now we have to use scan, because we have a relative cell reference in our dynamic spill array formula. There's the initial value, comma. The array I want to iterate, minus that, pound. And I want to always add 1 to the left plus the 1 above, so I use sum. And bam, there is our spilled amortization table with the correct 0 balance at the end.